Hello, this is Maeve. One sec, just letting everyone know I'm online. Just doing some art tonight. Um, oh right, Twitch chat. Must open Twitch chat. Oh good, the heater. I mean, I appreciate it being on, but uh, it's not good for my audio. That's some good background noise right there. Channel, Twitch chat. Oh, hello! To do a proper E? E you have to sound like a creaky door that wants crackers. Okay. Uh, drawing pad not working? Hello? I'm plugging. Hello? Hello? Ah, there it goes. How you doing, Pand? Jiggly? Good. Full of glitter dust? Very full oog. Oh no! Oog? I had like five hot dogs today. Were they chorizo hot dogs? No, I ate those last night. My god. The sausage in this panda. Too much sausage. Just doing a warm up. Deer has spoongles, I hope. I hope so. It's what I'm testing right now. I'm trying to draw red spinning with swords in the air. Like, I wonder how fast she'll be going. I wonder, like, exactly how many, like, giga shits per mega fart she'll be rotating at. Hopefully, very many, very fast. <laughs> I know you've been very dry. 
I know that's not my kind of humor, but I know you've been requesting it. <laughs> you needed it, so I delivered. My god. No good deed goes unpunished. <laughs> I know. Love you, Julian. I hope that keeps you not dry for a while. <laughs> I will be watered for days, my god. The crops will, will be fine this season. Rare red armpit. God damn it. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, a bottle fell. The fan or the uh, heater comes from the uh, ceiling and it blew it off the uh, table. Don't know why I'm recounting that. Uh, I know why. I'm I'm shy about making any sort of noise because I am traumatized. Lorelei now knows. No, my god! Hands do not seem to be possible for me tonight. Yeah, this is really bad. Delete. Do not save. Be gone. Okay, let's try something else. Any ideas? I want to see another dough pick. Otherwise, I got my request from earlier. I am dry. Otherwise, ideal wise. Oh yeah. Do you do you have any refs of a? Uh... Wait. Shit. Who is it you're wanting me to draw? Not Akako. Very good, thank you. I like how this character is supposedly just an awful villain and does not look at all of her art is adorable. I had to give you direction for the portrait, just know that she's very depressed, very intrinsically sad person. She's graying, and her fur is unkempt and overgrown in some places. Yeah, a lot of her art was driven by a certain dragon who wanted to see her all pure instead of what she actually is. I guess that's kind of sympathetic. I get that.
so beautiful eye reminds me of a doe. Aww. <laughs> McDonald indeed. Take it, Shan. Is it pronounced Shan or Sean? How's it said? Shan? Okay. Now, you'll have to tell me if you say anything in Discord because I'm scrolled up to her two pictures. And her pronouns are she, her, right? Am I remembering correctly? Here, yes, cool. Like Jai, she's also trans, but the other way around. Cool. Ye. I also like to draw horribly depressed trans women. Let me draw the full face shape first. She does not have a big head, which is kind of fun to play around with. Whereas, like, red, on the other hand, has an enormous head. It's just not big compared to the rest of her. Hey, Cass, how are you doing? Now, how do I rotate this?
Drawing from ref right now. I know this looks hideous, this is just getting like the skull down. Yes, shame. What kind of ears are these? Is she a red panda or are those cow ears? She's a red panda, okay. She has a scar over her left eye. Glad I noticed.
hoping this turns out okay. This might not be good. Yeah, no, that's pretty bad. So tired, yeah, that's what I'm going for, but I might not have structured this well enough despite my best efforts. Maybe that's okay. Oh, I think for describing the uh, picture, so tired. I think. I hope I didn't misinterpret that. You okay? I got sleep last night. Okay. I may have to redo the uh, irises at some point, but we'll see. I think I'm going to have to. Yeah, they're not looking in the same direction. I'm uncovering one. Yeah, they're looking in different directions, unfortunately. Lame. Do the one on the right. I like the slightly more downcast gaze of the one on the left. Sorry, I know this sucks to watch me do ovals over and over, but I'm trying to get the right angle. Yeah, that's good. Ovals are friend shape, ear friend shape. is friend shape.
And Julian, I'm so sorry to own you like that. You didn't deserve to be owned. Sorry to epic own you. Can you ever forgive me? I'm dead. No! I've epic owned my boy wife to death. No. <laughs> no. No. It's never forgiven. No. It's not perfect, but it will do. Okay, now for the Rhinarium. Googling Red Panda. Red Panda. Even though that's not what Imago is. I kind of want to read, read Imago though. That whole trilogy. Xenogenesis by uh, Octavia E. Butler is really phenomenal. right I did not it's not how red panda notes are she looks so dead this is deader than I expected I love it yay I'm glad I like to do um extremely depressed trans lesbians it's where my life force comes from didn't you know
you're not sure, add more eye darkening. really fucked up so yeah it suits her yeah adding some shiny bruising to the eyelids from crying she's fucked up yeah yeah <laughs> i mean that's my like that is my character trope if I make a character, she's gonna be fucked up. I draw fucked up trans lesbians, it's what I do. <laughs> a strained smile. Extra muscles are being used that uh, don't come with a normal natural smile. She's really forcing it. Yeah, I'm feeling good about those uh, miserable eyelids. Here. Fuck shit. Sketch. Your face when you lose your GF in a crusade because of your stupidity and you're thrusted onto a position of power because of your role in said crusade and have to maintain a public presence while also being evil as hell. No! And also, yes, please. Me, whose main character kills the universe. No, how could you do this to your character? Ah, it's so cruel and tragic. Me, main character, kills the universe. So don't forget the ice car. Oh yeah, thank you. I almost did.
You are the new hair layer. This layer was not used for hair, so I will delete it. Okay. <laughs> Miserable. Jesus Christ. Good fucking God, that's one unhappy panda. Scar getting drawn after hair, yeah? Yeah. In fact, I will make a marker for, or a layer for just be safe. Scar. Okay. Now, let me check both pieces. Okay, it's pretty distinctive. Now, how clean or jagged do you want this scar? Jesus, you capture her essence more than I have in years. Aw. Very jagged. It was a nasty cut. Okay, good. sword that's been buried for years did a number on her eye. Aw. Oh, right. Um, can she see out of this eye? She cannot. Okay. Hello. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? that what are you drawing uh, my partner is OC Shan who's a very like tragic villain very bad person very troubled person very hurting person
Does that work, or would you like me to, like, stylize her eye differently, Julian? I like that. Oh, okay. That works. If you're sure, I can, like, do something else if you want. It's all up to you. Of course, I could have it fully detailed. It's whatever you like. Cool. Thank you. What's her species? I'm not actually sure. A red panda with a... Uh, ox horns and ox features fully detailed okay you want fully detailed and if i color it i can just maybe do it like that that uh archetypal like baby blue for a you know i thought she was a skunk i guess red pandas are a little skunk like and i mean that in a good way because skunks are my best friends missing the horns in the ears I get the confusion yeah yeah now let me bring up more red panda art okay not red panda art just red panda pictures because I've never drawn a uh, red panda, so I need this kind of help. Here, fun. These are pretty fun to draw. Their ears look very bristly. I like it. Their ears are Dorito-shaped. Surprisingly Dorito-shaped. I consistently forget how Dorito-shaped they are. They've got little soras on both uh, bases. I'm in Smash. I am very happy about uh, Sora being in Smash. I think he's perfect. <laughs> okay. Now, do you know what species these horns are from?
Warcraft, they were Yongol horns. They're yak people, but let me pull up some references. Okay. Oh, yaks had beautiful horns. Good for them. Now, ox horns look very different from what I expected. Mm, that's another really good uh, ref of her. I like that one a lot. Okay. I see. She looks tired. Yeah, that's that is precisely what I'm going for. Maximum tired. Just maximum overtired. Somebody who looks like they haven't slept in like 50 years. Possibly hasn't. <laughs> So, are you wanting horns like those? Oh, friends. Yes, okay. They're... N oops, they're not gonna... Er, wait, one sec. Okay, layer, new layer, horn. Okay. Still surprised that Laura I knew what that Facebook page was. I used to, or currently admin. Um, <laughs> I love just having dark lore about the community and like that I've been there as like an active member and seen shit. I've seen all the shit. Oh no? What? Oh, and not how you want the horns? I can change them easily. The Facebook mod thing. Oh yeah, I I used to admin chubby anime girls on Facebook because <laughs> life is supremely bizarre. Now, how are these horns? Do you want do you want me to do a different style? How are you liking them? The horns are good though. Are you sure? I can I can do different horns. I am improvising here. So, let me know. Give me feedback so I can get something closer to what you want. They can be a bit shorter. Oh, do you want them to be able to fit on the canvas? Oops shorter a bit yeah yeah <laughs> mm. 
Ooh, wrong pen. I'm going for pencil here, baby. <laughs> I just found it very entertaining <laughs> that Lorelai knew the page I was talking about and lost it a little. Oh, that was good. That brought me, like, great entertainment. Maeve's cursed and storied past. Awful Facebook page. Not, not like, well, it has been toxic in the past. I did my best to, like, make that not be. But uh, just awful in that it's just, like, well, it's a Facebook page. Facebook produces, like, a certain type of content, and it's the reason I don't really go on Facebook. Except to, like, you know, d destroy people. Because I know most of the people there are, like, milk toast and humorless, so I just go on there to be, like, really aggressively trans. Really aggressively queer, just, just to ruin them. I say that, I think most of them don't actually care. But I can imagine. I can dream. Dreaming is the first step of making it reality. True. Ow, I just like swallowed so wrong. Ouchie. I guess this is how I die. to remember that this is a front-on view, so I need to get things symmetrical. Well, mostly symmetrical. Horns are not necessarily symmetrical. Okay. And imagine waking up and you can't get up and your horns are impaled in your headboard and or wall. <laughs> Busy night. I mean, you scoot up the wrong way. <laughs> Sleeping, you lewd dog. <laughs> Horniest ace on the internet. How are these? Those are great, what I imagine too. Are you sure? They look very, they look kind of like what's in the picture, although coming from a different part of the head. And they look very different from every past drawing of her. They're a very specific type of horn in past drawings, like coiled horns, but no, not coiled horns, like layered sheeted horns.
Oh, how tall is she? Ten foot one? Ten foot one? Um, what kind of weapon does she wield? She's massive? Good. Massive is correct. Massive as is as things should be. So ripped as hell despite her massive depression. Good. Really large axe. Also good. Broad shoulder is very correct. Good. This is a fun experiment, and if it fails, I can always just uh, delete this part.
Noob drawing a weapon? Yes. That's British for weapon. Pardon me. Hello. Yes, I would like to move all of this, please. Pardon? Oh, I see. She hot. <laughs> Yay. No, I'm trying to. Aw, I didn't mean to make Panda cry.
Adam's fucking axe. Literally obliterated three quarters of Jai, then it needs to be appropriately fucking big. Very proud of this geometric work right here. <laughs> Just so you know, I'm very proud of how that turned out. for overkill. No need for overkill, I say, drawing her holding an axe that's like as wide as she is tall, if not more so. Like, this is pretty extreme foreshortening. That is a Big axe. Like, let's see, let's see. Okay, let's point. Like, I'm thinking that's a very big axe. Oh, God. Oh, that is a horrific axe. Sad panda prepared to destroying. Amps, yes. Sorry to, sorry to give your bad guy a red prince style justice. I know, I know that's like not necessarily her thing. So large foreshortening operates in reverse when it is rendered. <laughs> That's not right. Come on. What are you doing? Like, her actual axe is 10 feet tall minus an inch or two, so it doesn't escape. So it doesn't scrape the floor. Yay. Everything. Come on, tool. Come on. What are you doing? Why are you doing this to me? Come on. Come on. Come on. The select tool's been being weird all night. There we go.
did I miss it? Did I... Yes, you did miss it by an hour and a half. <laughs> I snuck it in there real clever-like. In fact, my secret is that I had been uh, rehearsing it just so I could slip it in, like, surprisingly. here as fast as I could. I was riding the rails all day, bumming cigarettes off of commuters and stealing handbags from children. I appreciate your service. So these are ginkgo leaves because they, uh, Maeve, yeah, <laughs> because it's not my kind of humorous, so I had to like psych myself up to do it and know how I was gonna do it. Believe me, my heart was pounding because I'm like very shy. Maeve in front of the mirror every morning. <laughs> Monster. Oh, hey, we have ginkgo trees here. BRB pasta. Yee, have pasta. Ginkgo leaves. Um, they're often associated with, like, peace of mind, which uh, she clearly does not have. something uh, fleeting, blowing in the wind, escaping her. She doesn't have peace, no, no, no. It's upset serenity. Gotta write about the crusade as it is in Night Runner Nights. It was pretty terrible even without her girlfriend dying. Oh no. Scarrow. Hey, do you want a symbol on the face of this enormous axe? like wolf symbolism because in the end she's a lone, lone wolf. Very good. Oh, there's a dial for this. Very good. There's not really room for it because the center of the axe is way over here. Oh, God. Maeve, you're so smart. How am I so smart? Clearly, I am dummy for making axe too big. Rotate your canvas like some kind of fucking artist, goddamn. Um, I, I only did that this time. But no, rotating your canvas is really useful. In fact, if you're ever drawing a face from front on, you want to rotate your canvas to see if it's, um, if it's uh, actually symmetrical or not, because your eyes will trick you. Um, something that looks symmetrical... Uh, might not be. 
It might be pleasant to your eyes from one angle, but is not in fact symmetrical, and you want to uh, work on that. Um, here's the secret. I'll never look at it from another angle because I'm not a cop, so one angle is fine. That's fair. It's not necessary. I wanted a... Like, now that I'm thinking about it, wouldn't it have been amazing if, like, Mario threw the... Key? It was <laughs> sorry, Kingdom Heart from Smash Ult. Yes. Um... If Mario had thrown the Keyblade and it had revealed itself to be a Keyblade and then like right before anything could happen it got shot down and it was Saz Katsroy from a Final Fantasy 13 and it went, Saz Katsroy is coming. That would have been great. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> you don't know. You don't know. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Um, I can't open it because it's for Krita. Saz Katsroy. It's Saz Katsroy from Final Fantasy Thirteen, the the Cactuar. Um, in fact, I can find it on Google, I think, because the image exists because of my thumbnail. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is that thumbnail? I know I can find it on Google Images because of my thumbnail. Is it? Oh, maybe it's gotten buried. <laughs> Darn. <laughs> Final F Fantasy 13 just has the most fake Unreal names. I know, I love them. I googled him. It's fine, El Mayo. Um, <laughs> I see you're saying Mave disassociate, dissociating Saz Katsroy. Um, I mean, yeah, they chocobocalina. She goes chocobocalina. <laughs> Don't do that to me. Don't activate me. Come on, that's not fair. That's playing dirty. Um, I've got open Krita, I guess, to show it. God damn it. Chocobocalina. Um, she is one of the most powerful characters in the trilogy. Um. I can't believe I found a cursed activation button. I love Chocolina. Going to use this powerful for evil. You will destroy worlds. There. There. I, I had to show it. Who is this red bird lady? I want to hurt people. <laughs> what does that subtitle say? I'm not wearing glasses. How dare you? Um... <laughs> And that's my uh, YouTube thumbnail. You've told me what it said. <laughs> I, I already made the joke. But yeah, Saz is coming into Smash. <laughs> oh no. 
Okay. <laughs> oh. You, what do you want me to say? That's not something Maeve says on stream. Um. What does that say? Ugh. You're all foul. Foul, I say, having just made a joke about Saz coming into Smash. Um. But no, I. If you were to ask me. Maeve, what Final Fantasy character would you like to have in Smash Bros? It would probably be Saz, because Saz is, like, actually cool. I like Saz. Saz is a good boy. I threaten, like... My god! How do I kick the shit out of someone without hurting them? Oh, um... Actually, it has to do with, like, not actually doing anything violent, but being, like, gently shovey, like, pushing just a little, like, very obviously, like, fake. Like, that that's the point. Um, sounds boring. I'm getting a knife. That works, too. Um, but yeah, yeah, like, when I say I want to be bullied, I just mean I want to be, like, shoved gently into a cat. Like, not shoved, like, enough to even, like, push air out of me. Just kind of, like, you know, impressed upon the couch. I want to be suggested upon the couch. My god, we actually had a very scary discussion a few months ago that involved people talking about how much they like gunplay. Oh my god! Um, punch it in the face, but gently. I'll get the swords from my library. Oh yeah, you have swords in your library. Rich panned. Um, yeah, gunplay scary. Scaro. Um, on that note, though, I believe I have to go. Um, I will do more work on this later, I think, because I'm not satisfied with it yet. But I have to go watch a scary movie. A Scaro movie. And then we've got to organize a watch party in the server for, um... At the very least, um, give me the work in progress first, please. Of course. Do you want it with all the layers or just the PNG? PNG? Cool. Um, I would also like to watch Over the Garden Wall, if possible. That's one of my favorite shows. I, I adore that show, and each episode's like 11 minutes long, I think, because it was a, like, mini-episodic mini-series. Sort of like Adventure Time format, but uh, shorter. Really, really good show. Um, I would love to see that. In fact, I watch that every Halloween. Okay, I'm gonna go. This is Maeve. I don't think I'll be on again tonight. Um, I have to get up early tomorrow so I can go to a comic book shop for it's like, I don't know why, but it's a new comic book shop and it has a new comics, comic books day? I don't know what that entails. I don't even know if it comes with like free stuff. But on that note, I do have to go. Um, I love you all, especially you, Julian, and I will be back on tomorrow to do probably more drawing and maybe fast mech game, maybe stream some Destiny, because I might be a Destiny streamer. My apologies to, like, everyone. Literally everyone. Okay. Night night. I love you all. And I'll get that PNG to you. Mm, bye bye Oh, uh, this is Maeve, by the way. I'm very scattered tonight. Follow me. Click that motherfucking like button, baby. Oh, love you.